Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to Gadgets123. Thanks again for all the like, comments, subscriptions. Awesome thumbs up. You guys are amazing. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, subscribe. We're doing a giveaway once we reach a thousand subs. So please subscribe to participate in that mystery box giveaway. All right, guys. So we have three budget mounts for your car. Now we got a combination of this one is a, a vent mount, windshield mount, and this is a windshield slash dashboard mount. So we're going to do a little versus between all three of them and see which one is best for you. So stay tuned and let's get started. Guys, so here's the actual vent mount. As you can see, I placed it with a phone. It has the actual Note 9 on it. Very cool, very solid. As you can see right there, it's holding it like a champ. The legs do help it support it. And very sturdy. All you have to do is tighten the back and it does the job that it needs to do to hold these massive phones. If you guys notice in the back, we do have the actual vent mount being held by this little kind of mouth it has and all you have to do is just turn this little wheel which is this one right here and this will tighten it up this one will tighten the actual head of the actual mount but overall not real complaints very solid very sturdy uh, let me just go here real quick there we go there you go and that is the beyond vent mount Here's the other one, if you wanna go on the cheap route, this is the universal uh, dashboard mount. Uh, windshield mount, actually. I'm sorry, this is not the dashboard, this is the windshield mount. Now again, it would not mount into your actual dashboard right here. It would only mount into the windshield itself. Very simple design, all you have to do is just connect this to the windshield, and this little wheel tightens up the actual mount itself. All right, guys, as you can see, it's holding my Note 9. However, it's very, I don't know, kind of flimsy overall, and it does shake a lot because it has no real support except for these two little things right in the middle. Um, overall, it's one of the least liked for me. It, um, it's kind of really flimsy, and every time you drive, it kind of starts vibrating. It starts just moving like that all over the place, and I don't like that, especially if you have one of the bigger phones. You will have a problem with it with the shaking part. It does shake a lot when you drive it. So this is not one of my favorite ones. In fact, this is the least favorite of, of all three mounts that we're doing right now. All right, guys, so lastly, we have the universal dash and windshield mount, as you could see right here. Very cool, this is actually a lot more sturdy than the other one, just because it does have the legs. And as you could see, if we expand the legs, and you can put it in different positions, in fact, you could also expand it, as you could see back here right now. See how big, I, I made it as big as possible, just so it could reach my steering wheel and I could have easier access to it. Very durable, this one definitely could put it either on your windshield or you could put it on your dashboard. Um, like the design, the arm is really thick, which actually helps uh, give it that additional support. Unlike the previous one we just reviewed, which was the windshield one, uh, the arms, as you can see right here, and the legs give it that extra support that will allow this phone to stay sturdy in one location without actually, you know, moving or, or trembling when you're driving around town. As you can see, it's currently in my dashboard. The uh, adhesive and suction cup give it that additional support. And if I want to put it on my windshield, it will do the job. Uh, as well as it does it when you put it in dashboard mount. So again, this one's a legit universal dashboard and windshield mount. Haven't had any issues with this one. Like this one as well as the vent mount. Again, my least favorite one is the windshield mount that we reviewed. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this little demonstration of all three mounts uh, currently being used in the car or at least placed in the car. All right, guys, 
So hopefully you guys enjoyed that little demonstration. Now, again, all these mounts are available in Amazon. I'm going to link them in the description, whichever you like best. But overall for me, I would have to go with the Beyond vent mount. This is one of my favorite ones. I do like vent mounts. They're uh, easier for me to use. And the way the dashboard in my car is displayed is, is the vent mounts. The actual vent uh, is really close to my steering wheel. So a uh, mount uh, in that location will fit me perfectly. My least favorite one, it was this universal windshield one, uh, mount. Again, the design of it is really flawed. I don't like basically this little, the way this is made. Um, when you place a phone on it, it's, it, it starts vibrating after a while. It starts shaking. It has no real support either on the right or on the left. And that actually compromises the phone from either vibrating when you're driving uh, on the highway or it might fall off if it starts you know, shaking too many times and it just pops out for no reason at all. Again, very simple design. However, it is flawed when it comes to uh, securing your phone in a specific location so not one of my favorite ones right now it's in fact one of my least favorite ones from all the ones I've reviewed including these three models and lastly the vent slash I mean I'm sorry the uh, windshield slash dashboard mount is actually pretty pretty sturdy uh, one of the drawbacks again this is just in my opinion for me is it's just the size of it it's really really big uh, I need something more compact and that's why I picked the vent mount just because this one has way too many moving parts when it comes to um, using it. Now if you got like a, a truck, a van or something and you think uh, your dashboard is a little bit uh, on the far side, this actually might do the trick for you. Uh, one of its pluses is it's very thick, very very um, secure unlike the, this model right here this one is definitely something that you could pretty much use and not have the phone fall off or start shaking all over the place this one is very very secure but i think for me especially for the car i have and um, what my needs are i'll stick with the vent mount but no real drawback on this actual mount um, really like it it's just uh, for me it's too big it's too big of a mount and the Beyond one is actually the perfect size, especially for the uh, design of my car and where the uh, vent mount is. All right, guys. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that little demonstration. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Uh, if you're planning on getting either of these models, check out the description. It's going to be linked there. And uh, you could take you directly to Amazon and you can pick it. Again, these are all budget universal mounts they're basically available in amazon i believe the prices go from as cheap as ten dollars to twenty to twenty five i believe again everything's going to be linked down in the description so check that out guys thumbs up to everybody thanks again for all the like comment subscriptions if you seen to the end of the video thank you very much we're doing a giveaway when we reach a thousand subs the only um requisite you need to be is subscribe to the channel if you subscribe to the channel when we reach a thousand sub, we're gonna do the thousand uh, sub video, and in that video, we're going to do a mystery box giveaway. We're going to put a combination of different items, including one of these things, uh, with other stuff that we have reviewed from our first review to our a thousand sub review, and we're gonna just package all that in and send it to one lucky winner for uh, supporting the channel. Again. Thanks again for everything, guys, and hopefully stay tuned to the next video, and I'll see you again. Take care, guys.